You see, I told you. I told you. I had to turn my light on. Believing she was Hepshedset, the guardians allowed her in the secret chambers, and she let me in. By the energy on that wall, I don't know what it is. She blessed me. Her temple. Hello, welcome to my YouTube channel. Let's get into it. I'm Kenyatta, the Art Kate. On this channel, we destroy, we destroy and build simultaneously as there can be no resurrection without destruction. Once again, I am Kenyatta, but you will refer to me as Miss Kenyatta, Queen, Goddess, Empress, Ma'am. There's no other name by which I will respond unless I give, tell you another name to call me. Okay. I have no foes or enemies on this platform, nor any other. If you are here to enjoy the reading, take what resonates, leave the rest by nature of some of the readings. There may be aspects that you feel you don't resonate with, but since they are God-given dreams, visions, and insights, it is essential and imperative for you that you use your God-given third eye to catch what is for you. There is something in all of my readings that will resonate in some way, for that is why you have been sent. Disrespect, a spirit of lack. A hunger for ignorance and being common with me or anyone else who supports me on this channel will not be tolerated in my realm. Now open your hearts, minds, souls, spirits, and be ready to receive, conceive, and then birth. Let's build here. This will be a reading from the Rider Waite Tarot Deck. The title of this reading is A House Divided Against Itself Cannot Stand. Now hold on, be patient, be patient. Looking for the scripture. Guess I should have had it together before I got on, but I didn't. Matthew 12, 22 through 28. Then one was brought to him who was demon possessed, blind and mute, and he healed him so that the blind and the mute man both spoke and saw. And all the multitudes were amazed and said, could this be the son of David? Now when the Pharisees heard it, they said, this fellow does not cast out demons except by Beelzebub, the ruler of the demons. Now, I look this, I'm, I'm still in the middle of the passage. I looked this up a couple days ago and I don't know what website it was. But they had the verse, and where the word Jesus was is, they put Yeshua in bold letters. The first time I had ever seen it, as many times as I looked up Bible verses, okay, on the internet, okay? And I thought, wow, wow that's interesting. And, um, but I don't remember which device it was on, and I don't have it now. Now, this one I'm looking at says Jesus, but I will put Yeshua there. And it made me think. I said, I wonder, are they going to change it? You know, like, and call it, uh, what are they calling this thing um, we're going, that they say we've been going through? Um, what's his name? Uh, oh, Lord, I got his face. Hold on, let me think. Okay, and you know, I call it the Mandela effect. You know, and people be walking around, well, I remember when it said Jesus. <laughs> no, it never said Jesus. Okay, well, either they change everything. You know, I, I don't know if they're printing all the shit up, okay, or when they throw us into another time, uh, I don't know, another dimension or another time, okay, and we don't realize the shit, but just wake up one day like, it feels different. But let's keep on going. But Yeshua knew their thoughts and said to them, Every kingdom divided against itself is brought to desolation, and every city or house divided against itself will not stand. Like, duh, right? 
If Satan casts out Satan, he is divided against himself. How then will his kingdom stand? And if I cast out demons by Beelzebub, by whom do your sons cast them out? Okay. So he's saying, if he do it by Beelzebub, how, who, who you do it by? Huh? Therefore, they shall be your judges. But if I cast out demons by the Spirit of God, surely the kingdom of God has come upon you. I'm hearing there are accusations. Accusations I'm hearing that fly about by the breath of one's tongue. This is what I'm hearing. <laughs> I'm hearing this energy has no clue. They have no understanding. They are wrought. I, I believe that's the word. Okay, a wrought. Okay, I have to look up that word. Okay, with myth, misunderstandings. They don't know. They don't challenge themselves to know. I am here. They only challenge you to be wrong. They want you to be wrong, constantly wrong all the time. You don't know what you're talking about, that type of thing, okay? This is the energy that they come in. This is the energy that they send you, okay? They want you to be seen as a fool, okay? I am hearing a dynamic fool. Something about of the brethren or something. I don't know what that is, okay? Maybe it'll come up later. Of the brethren, okay, uh, maybe just of others. They want others to see you as a fool, okay. I'm hearing loose lips, but then I heard loose lips sink ships, okay. This person is a liar, a thief, I am hearing, okay. A stealer, stolen, okay. They like to steal, they like to copy. I'm hearing other people's workmanship, okay. Other people's work, okay, and call it their own, okay. They steal. Okay. They're a liar, but like want to call you like the father of lies or something like that, okay? Want to accuse you before the brethren. There it is, okay? Want to accuse you before the brethren, okay? You know, like that's that biblical talk, <laughs> before the brethren, okay? Old school, I'm hearing, okay? They want you to lie or to be perceived as a lie and a liar, okay? But I am hearing, but a house divided against itself cannot stand. A house divided against itself will not stand. Okay. I am hearing this is obvious, for they are dumb, okay, dumb and foolish to even perceive this as truth or want you to be perceived this way or to want you to be perceived as uh, not speaking the truth, as, as like what they're saying is the truth, okay, when it's a lie. Okay, they are known to lie. They are here. They are a known liar. Okay, and people know this. This is what I'm hearing. People know that this person lies. Okay, or this energy or whatever this is. Okay, cop out. I'm hearing. Okay, something about a cop out. They use you as a cop out or something like that. Okay, okay. something about using you. Okay, um, to some hear this word is again perceive their lies as truth. They want to use you in that regard, okay? Call on you, say you, okay? Your name, boldly so, okay? But they're a liar, they're lying, okay? I'm here before the courts even. Ooh. They go to the courts on you and lie. They lie to these people about you, okay? I'm hearing something about to the effect, I don't know to the effect that you will be perceived as the liar they are. But they are not, okay, perceived or seen as a truth teller. Interesting, I'm here, they know this. I keep hearing perceived, golly, okay? But they want to, you know, this to be the perception in other words, okay? That you are a liar and they are a truth teller. Everything that they say, I'm hearing, is a lie. Their words are lies. I mean, like, forced out, okay? It's like they cannot help it. They try to help it. There are times that they try to help it, but they can't help it. It's too strong in them, okay? The abundance of lies, okay, and being a liar is too strong in them to overcome. They cannot help it, okay? 
they will not help it. But I'm also hearing they will not win, okay? I'm also hearing they've already lost, okay? But they perceive that they have won against you and others, okay? Others that are like you, others that speak truth, okay? Speak words of truth. They don't want you to win, okay? I don't know what it is, win what? I'm, I'm like, when what? <laughs> and I'm hearing themselves. I don't know what that means. Themselves. They want to be the best. They want to be the only one. They want only, want to be the only one known, okay, for knowing anything. Again, perceiving anything. I don't know what the fuck is, a, is about this word, perceive and perception. Let's get into it here. We have nine of cups in reverse, okay? Six of wands in reverse. The temperance card, upright. 10 of swords, upright. And here we have the knight of cups in reverse, okay? I keep hearing it, okay? Sorry if it's repetitive. Okay, but again, this person is a liar, okay? This person is not happy. They're not satisfied with their life, with the way things are going. I'm hearing this person has lied so much, they done lied themselves out of, I don't know, I'm hearing something about stocks and bonds. I don't know, okay? Maybe, it, maybe that's, that could just mean maybe like um, of some kind of a reassurance or um, a security net or something like that, okay, of what could have been for them. This is, okay, what I, this is what I'm hearing. What could have happened for them. The sanctity I'm hearing of happiness, home, built, okay, upon words of truth, okay, but they decided to go the opposite way. And in their uh, movement toward the opposite way of what was truth, Okay, they lost, I'm here, they lost it all here, okay? They're not sitting in this place of victory, okay? Where they could have been, but they decided, I'm hearing, to lie, to be a liar, a force of lies. I feel like there was some kind of energy that overtook them, okay? It's like in the midst of a lie, okay? A lie. Okay, I feel like this energy, this force overtook them and it became greater and greater and greater and more and more and more, okay? To the point and place where it was outrageous, okay? Uh, they might have lied on you, okay? Said some things about you that were not true, okay? Maybe some kind of, um, I feel like you brought this person balance, Temperance. I'm hearing you help to temper them. Show them new things. Show them a new way. Okay? Show them something better, something different, something more prosperous, okay, than needing to be in this, you know, type of, I'm here heinous energy to lie. Constantly lying. Why lie? Why are you lying? There's no need to lie. Be free. Set yourself free from the lies. Okay, but they lied on you, okay, and brought you down or sought to bring you down, okay? Like I say, they thought you was going to just see this, but here, regardless, okay, if you're some kind of earth angel or something like that, okay, star seed, chosen person, okay, so on and so forth, angel, okay, you just maybe, just, maybe not just earth angel, maybe just angel, period, and they didn't realize it or whatever the case may be here, okay, here, Regardless of what happens here to you in this earthly realm, you still see this, okay? Because you're this. All right, let's continue on. Here we have the high priestess in reverse. Ten of cups in reverse. Eight of cups upright. Okay. And the king of pentacles upright, okay? Obviously, okay, no love was shown for you here, okay? No mercy, no grace, no nothing, okay? I'm just going to lie on this person, okay? Perceive, okay? And, you know, make it be perceived as though this person is a liar, okay? No good, okay? Stretched out, okay? 
stretch out for those who know. When trouble come, the storm begin to rise. Hold on and learn to stretch out. I don't worry, I don't fret, I just stretch out. See, when trouble come, when trouble come, the storm begin to rise. Hold on, even though you got the swords in your back, hold on and learn to stretch out. It's not going to stay this way. The sun is there on the horizon. I don't worry, I don't fret. I just stretch out, knowing that the love ain't there. It is what it is. Boom. This person ain't got to love me, okay? You ain't got to love. I'm here. Okay. If there is no love, okay? I'm here now where it's sanctity again, okay? I don't know if it was this reading or the last one I did, okay? No, no need to worry. I just stretch out. I feel like this person here, okay, was void of understanding. This is what I'm hearing. This is what you were hearing in the, like the channel message as I was shuffling. They were void of understanding, okay? Not in their intuition. Not understanding. Or if they were, they were ignoring it. Okay, because I'm hearing this person chose. They had a choice. They chose to go against you, Okay. When I'm here, when it was unnecessary, there was no reason for it, okay? But but this, the, these are the things that people do. They, they feel like they got a reason. Okay, seeing a tree in a whole fucking, but not the whole fucking forest. Okay. So maybe they chose to ignore their intuition. But I also feel that they, the perception was to make you look like, you know, you were not an intuitive person, that you didn't know nothing, okay? Although I feel like here, like I said, you may, might have been some kind of angelic being starcy. But again, as the reading said, you brought this person some kind of balance, temperance, help temper them, their nature. But they didn't like it. They didn't want it. I don't want you. Okay. Now, you know, I was talking to someone the other day and we were talking about people getting tarot readings and how sometimes a person get a tarot reading next thing you they come to you for help and next thing you know here they are attacking the shit out of you and it's like well goddamn you asked me for a fucking tarot reading you asked me for some fucking help now next thing I know I'm sleeping at night and I see you coming at me and you throwing your shit at me and evil I knew what the fuck is this all about but one thing he said, he said, I said, that don't make no sense. But he said, it does in a way. I love talking to people. I love learning from others. And they learn from me as well. We are all one. One person got all the answers, huh? One person know every fucking thing. So if you can learn from others, would you go to school to learn from others? Goddamn, they, they, they say this earth is a fucking school. You don't know who the fuck is who. You don't know who's there to help you on your journey of ascension while you're living in this human fucking suit and you're trying to make your way all through the murky waters of that shit, of them human fucking experiences. But one thing, and I, and I looked at him, he said, if the person came to a tarot reader for assistance to help them and it did help them that dark thing in them that they wanted help for in the first place that motherfucker's mad than a motherfucker confirmation that dark shadowy shit that's in him that spirit that demonic energy whatever the fuck it is it's me i say yeah i get it <laughs> that mother what the fuck you mean now i got to messing up my steel i've been housed here for a long motherfucking time in comfort, eating off this motherfucker, and now you wants to try to clean me out. Where shall I go? When they asked them uh, demonic spirits, and Jesus was like, get, get up out of that, that man, and they well, where are we going to go? Go to the, to the swine, goddamn. They got to go somewhere. You cleaning them out, but you're not telling them where to go. You're mad as shit. Okay? 
So this person here, okay, once again, they may not have been, you know, they, I, don't want your, I don't want your temperance, your love, your energy, your nothing. Now that might have been that dark aspect of them that they had not worked on yet or that was challenging them to overcome it, to overtake it, and to say, yeah, vamos, you got to go, motherfucker. We all got that shit. But there was something here that they did not want you to uh, have or experience. Okay. Didn't want you to be a blessing. I am, hearing, I am hearing to them as well as others. Okay. So whatever uh, you were building with this person, the balance that was here, so on and so forth, they walked away from it. Okay, they walked away from you. But damn, they walked into doing some treacherous ass shit to you, which here I am hearing again was not needed, was not necessary. Okay. Maybe it has something to do with the King of Pentacles. Okay. Maybe they thought doing this was going to bring them some bounty as well and some abundance. Okay. I'm hearing they did. But as well, there was someone there. Okay. Maybe someone told them to do this shit. Okay. I pay you. I gladly pay you on Tuesday for a cheeseburger or a hamburger today, whatever that motherfucker said. Okay, so in other words, I gladly pay you on Tuesday to go do that to that person today. A house divided against itself cannot stand. It might, okay. It might have been that whoever this person was that did this to you, maybe you all were supposed to do some kind of work together. Okay, maybe some spiritual work together. And maybe the person who was gladly paying the person who was still kind of overshadowed by this. I ain't saying you was perfect now and you didn't have no issues. And I know I'm not talking about in our divinity. I'm talking about in the, our humanity. And I'm not saying that you were perfect in your humanity, that you didn't have some issues here. But I feel like this person here, if they were paid to do this to you, okay? Whoever paid them, maybe this motherfucker here who gladly paying them on Tuesday for some bullshit today. Okay? Saw that this person was still, saw their weakness. Saw their dark, that dark aspect. And utilized it for their benefit so that you could not stand, so the house could not be built. Queen of Wands, in reverse. The hangman, in reverse, uh, upright, excuse me, and the justice card, in reverse. They did not want you to stand. I am hearing. And I don't mean just you, maybe this person, if you were supposed to do some kind of work with this person. Maybe some kind of spiritual work with this person. This person who gladly paid this motherfucker on Tuesday for some bullshit today had a clear understanding. Them two together, three or four, whatever the fuck it is, okay, to do this great spiritual work for the Lord. We can't have that shit. Who's the weakest link, goddamn? Or who displays their uh, weakness more so than the others? That's the one you go after. Not saying that you didn't have some weakness. Not saying that the other people didn't have some weakness. And maybe they played on your weakness too, but in a different way. To dismantle the work that the Lord had sent for you all to do. I feel like whatever it was, this person, hmm, hold on. I feel like this person was turned in, just into a hateful motherfucker. I'm hearing they hate themselves. They hate the world. They hate you. They hate everything that is, everything that was, everything that could be. This person is stuck as a result. See, this is, people people wicked than a motherfucker. <laughs> you understand know what I'm saying? There are, I don't want to just say people in general. I don't want to say that. There are energies that are wicked. 
if the very elect could be deceived, but maybe they weren't the very elect because it says if the very elect. I don't know. Okay. But there was deception here on the part of this energy here, this King of Pentacles upright. I'm going to pay you some shit for tomorrow, but do this shit today. And I'm here, and they did it. And they were paid, but not enough. Maybe they didn't give them everything they told them they would give them. I don't know. Okay. There was some more work for them to do. And I'm feeling like this person was like, but you told me to do this. Shouldn't that be enough? No, there's more. And when you do the more, then you can get this. You know how they string you along. This was not, this was a great injustice, not only to you, okay, or to this person here who was uh, uh, betrayed, backstabbed, lied on, so on and so forth. This was an injustice to this person who allowed it to happen, okay, and it was an injustice to others who were going to be, um, I feel like, assisted, helped with the energy that would have been great if, if, if this had come together in the way that it was supposed to. But it didn't. But I am in God got a backup plan. It don't make a difference. Okay, God knows all, sees all. But we do have free will. We do have choices. Let's see what they do with it. Because I feel like it was about you too. Not just this person. Four of Pentacles in reverse. Seven of Pentacles. Okay. In reverse, in the chariot, in reverse. I feel like, like I said, this was a great injustice, okay? And this person is stuck, okay? Turn them to, into some kind of hateful energy here, okay? And I feel like they want to let go of this here, okay? But I'm hearing but they're not being allowed to. You're going to hold on to this shit, okay? I'm hearing, okay? I control you now. You're going to hold on to this shit and do what the fuck I tell you to do, okay? When I tell you to do it and how I tell you to do it. I don't know why I'm here in birth of our Lord. It could be from my last reading because that was the name of the reading I just did. All right. Let's keep on going here. Okay. I feel like this person here is this uh, duped. What, 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 what he say? Uh, hoodwinked. Lied on, lied to. Oh, I've been lied on, cheated, talked about, mistreated. Okay. That ain't really, that really don't fit necessarily. I, you know, I just heard lied to and that song came to my mind. <laughs> okay. All right. I feel like this person was hoodwinked, lied to, so on and so forth. Okay. Canceled. I'm hearing canceled up out of their birthright. Okay. But the choice, the choice was made. Okay, I feel like this person is not doing well, okay, not able to stand on solid ground. I'm here financially or otherwise, okay, and it, they want the shit to stop. But it's not. Because a choice was made. You made the choice here. And now you have to pay for what the choice that you made here, okay? Now, hold on. I feel like they're still using this person here. Okay, with this, a house divided against itself cannot stand. You best say this person ain't this, and you best say this person ain't that. And maybe not just you, maybe others. Okay? Go against the body I am hearing. Okay? The collective. Okay, now I'm not talking about, I'm talking about um, the called, the chosen I am hearing. Go against them. Speak against them. Speak heavy words against them. Okay? And I'm even hearing this person saying to this person, see, this is what you were supposed to do. You were supposed to rock with them, be with them. But you chose this space. You chose this space and time. You chose this energy. I got you, I'm hearing. Okay? I got you now. I'm hearing collectively. I don't know. Maybe it's more than one. Well, obviously, it would be more than one person, more than one energy. Okay. But I'm hearing, but there are others here. 
okay, who were mandated, okay, to walk in this way, okay, based off of whatever, like I said, okay, issues. That's, that's why, you know, I, people say it's so important to do your shadow work. Just find out who you are, discover yourself. Okay, this, I'll pay you on Tuesday for some bullshit today, worldly, nothing. Okay, sell that over your soul. Any description about that? What profit is a man to gain a whole fucking world illusion shit that's going to fall away to nothing? Okay. And lose his own soul. His ability here or her to manifest on their own because of the greatness of their being, their soul being. This is what these energies want to dismantle. And I'm here and you played a part in that. Okay. For whoever this may resonate with. So, this is what's being done here. A house divided against itself will not stand. It is made, maybe made to appear that everyone's in the same house. <laughs> okay? When, it, when they're not. A house divided against itself will not stand. This energy here, this person here, or these energies, okay, have sold themselves, okay? In whatever way, shape, or form, you sold whatever. I don't know, goddamn, okay? Something. Okay? For this house to not stand. I mean, but it will stand, okay, regardless of what you or anyone else says or thinks about it. All right. Please like, share, and subscribe. Help me hit a thousand subscribers. Y'all be blessed. Peace. Ah. Uh... My God, be unjust. I have not seen my God be unjust. I have not seen my God be unjust. Unjustified in his way, unjustified. In his will, unjustified in his way. I have not seen. My God, be unjust. I have not seen my God, be unjust. I have not seen my God be unjust, unjustified in his will, unjustified in his way, unjustified in his way, unjustified in his way. 
release your hold on today. Those things that keep you astray, astray from his will, astray from his love, astray from his life meant for you on this day. My God, my God, <clears throat> God, my God, my God, oh, my, my God.